Hey guys, alright. This came, I opened up, starter set, Judge Dread. And we're gonna run through it. And what I did was I ordered this extra box with it. Uh, when you order the starter set, Warlord Games gives you this right here as a incentive to buy. This is Judge Dread special miniature. Uh, Judge Dread versus Judge Death. And um <coughs> excuse me. Yeah, we'll pop this out a little bit and we'll show you what the fig is. Right. Get your base. Couple of arms. So, get Judge Dredd right here. Take that little piece off, and the judge fits in like that. And that is a pretty cool mini, right? Not too bad. So that's that's a gimme when you buy the starter set. Well, let's take a gander at this thing and uh, see what we got. Thank you, Walmart. All right. Um, Judge Dread, I believe this is the uh, the bike and the dread. Now the last video I had I got my strontium dog and now this is the Judge Dread 2000 AD which I believe are compatible. We got some cards here. A lawmaster. Hmm. So I have to pretty tight. Simona and Boss. So what do we got here? We got the Lawmaster card. Judge Joe Dredd. Electronic override device. Opens any door. And drop it card. Big Meg. Oh, this looks neat. This is a resin. Goes together pretty well. Just like that. And that's a resin bike. That's pretty cool, huh? I like that. That's pretty neat. And we got... Another dread, this is a hard plastic. Pretty cool. And then we have the dread figure right there. And the handlebars that would go on. So they'll be going there like that. So that's pretty neat. I like that, that's not bad. Now, I, I bought that extra. This is an extra box. I ended up going ahead and purchase, purchasing that. Alright, so let's see what we have for the box itself. So we have this. And let's see. Uh, Judge Dread. I am the law. So this is the box set, Judge Dread. I Am The Law Starter Set. And it comes with 10 Warlord resin miniatures with plastic bases. One street judge, one rookie judge, eight block gangers. 120 page rule book. Uh, eight page quick start scenario booklet. Double sided gaming mat. Full color double sided die cut card scenery. 
7 unit cards, 18 armory cards, 18 big meg cards, full color water slide mega city graffiti sheet, plastic game tokens, 2 six sided spot dice, and 8 combat dice. Alright, let's check it out. The Judge Dread I Am The Law Miniatures game is a tabletop battle game for two or more players set in 2000 AD, longest running universe, the world of jo Judge Joseph Dread. Dread is the archetype of, dyst of dyst dystopian futures, sprawling mega cities house what's left of humanity in the aftermath of the 21st century atomic wars. Their citizens are closely packed mass of resentment, indolence, and rampant crime. Only the ruling Justice Department's grim-faced judges, trained from childhood to act as judge, jury, and executioner, can keep the peace and prevent a descent into anarchy. In Judge Dread, I Am the Law, players take control of small teams of judges and criminals to fight out street and rumbles, raids, and ambushes in the mean streets of Mega City 1. The start of set contains all the rules you need to play, including scenarios, advanced rules, and profile lists to create your teams, such as the judges, block gangs, and block gang included in this set, and more Mega City inhabitants, such as the city deaf units, fatties, robots, mutants, re renowned characters, and much, much more. Cool. Let's see what we got. Okay, this is... The Judge Dread Quick Start Rules on the Mean Streets of Sector 43. So that being the case, we've got Sugar Rush, the setup. Pretty neat. Half Eagle Day. The artwork's pretty neat. Look at the figures. The figures are pretty cool. The artwork's cool. Sweet Justice. So. That's a quick start scenario booklet. That's what that is. Alright. So we got that. Warlord Games catalog, which I thought was pretty neat. This actually came with the box. When I ordered it. SPQR, Bolt Action, Blood Red Skies, Cruel Seas. That sub is awesome. Look at that sub coming out. It's pretty cool. I don't have this game set, but it looks really cool. You got the Japanese Imperial Fleet, U.S. Navy. You got a couple of sinking ships, submarines, tankers. You got the German Kriegsmarine and the British Royal Navy over there. Pretty neat. And we got Conflict 47. Your paint sets, black powder, pike and shot. Hail Caesar. Oh, cool. Antares, Warlords of Erwin. You got Warlord Battle Sets. You got the Rook's Drift. Look at this one, the Battle of Berlin Battle Set. That looks pretty, pretty cool. Look at that. Look at that right there, that one. Oh, sorry guys. Battle of Berlin right there. Pretty neat. And then you got Liberty of Death, The Longest Day, which is pretty cool. Pegasus Bridge and La Hassan. So Rogue's Drift is 195 pounds, $310 in American. The Battle for Berlin is 200 pounds, 320 American. The Pegasus Bridge, 195 pounds, 310 American. La Hassan, the battle. Uh, 195 pounds, 310 American, Liberty of Death, 195 pounds, 310 American. Longest day, same thing, 195 pounds and 310 American. And we got extra bits. Pretty cool. Alright. We'll go over the rule book in a minute. 
Let's see what we got for figures. All right. So let's see. So we got this guy here. Pretty cool. Pretty neat. And the guy there. I think that's yeah, that's a that's a female. Oops. Pretty cool. Alright, so she won't stand up because she gotta clear off that extra bit there. There's a judge. She's pretty neat. I used to like like uh, oh look at that. There's a judge. Pretty cool. This is another ganger. And another ganger. Pretty neat. Like them. Not bad. Okay, so we have those. And we got these dice. And we got these markers. Let's see if I can get a plain backdrop. Will that work? Will that work? Yeah, no. So they're pretty cool. Got the logo on it. Blue markers. So we got blue two blue markers. One gold marker. Alright. Bang, boom, bang, blood drops, whatever. Uh, look at this graffiti. This is pretty cool. Look at that. That's nice. I like that. That's pretty neat. Decal sheet with all kinds of weird stuff on it. Then we've got the cards. Cards here as well. You know, all kinds of different cards that go with the game. Okay. Then you got this, you got bases for your figs here. More cards. What is this? What is this? Oh wow! Okay, that is. This is your uh, double-sided play mat. Oh wow! That's pretty neat. Look at this. Look at that. That's it. Okay, check that out. That's pretty neat, huh? Wow. And that right there. That's pretty cool. Shoes. Alright. And then we have some cardboard. Oops. We've got some cardboard things to come out the terrain. All right, so that's cool. I can dig that. All right, so now what do we got? So now we got. Got that, right? Then 
Now we're going to take a look at the rule book. Oh, the artwork's awesome. Look at that. That's pretty cool. I am the law. Core rules, armory, denizens of Mega City 1, scenarios, and to live and die in Mega City 1. The artwork is awesome. I love games, um, all that game stuff. There's the core rules, get all the markers. Pretty neat. I like that. That's She's cool. Look at that. Mmm. Smell of freshly printed, huh? Wow. These gangers look pretty cool. Love the artwork. Look at that. That's that's awesome. Look at that artwork right there. Oh, look at that artwork right there. That's pretty pretty neat. It really is. Wow. Strontium dogs. Yep. Wow. Look at that owl, it's so cool. If you like the old 2000 AD comic books, man, you are gonna love this set. It is just, it just rocks. Wow. Look at that, look at that artwork. Wow, guys, this is pretty, pretty cool. Get your cards. Look at this. 